Hi there, my name's Vince from MyMateVince.com and in this video today I'm going to show you how you can easily connect up your Nintendo Switch to a DVI monitor. Now, when you buy your Switch you'll get a HDMI lead with it, so what you can do is you can just buy one of these adapters which is a HDMI female to a DVI male and you can just plug that in. That side will go into the back of your monitor and this side will go into your Switch or what I prefer to do is I prefer to actually use a HDMI to a DVI cable which I've got connected up at the moment. If you're thinking about reusing your DVI cable itself you're going to struggle because you're going to have to convert it to HDMI and the problem is this bit here is too wide to get into the Nintendo Switch dock because the port is at the very bottom and it fouls it so you won't be able to use this setup here. Now if you have a look this is what I've done. I've got a little HDMI there, nice little cable, three meter cable, go into the back of the monitor there, so this is the DVI one there. Now on this monitor, it has got speakers, but through DVI, it doesn't push through the sound when it's coming from the HDMI from the back of the dock. So you will have to connect sound up a different way. So as you can see, the picture works fine and it's 1080p. It's just as good quality as using the HDMI. In fact, often using a monitor can give you better results than using a TV. But what you will have to do is you're going to have to use the headphone jack off the Nintendo Switch to get sound out of it. So at the moment I've just got this very basic little Bluetooth speaker but I've just connected a 3.5mm plug into it and then I'll plug in the other 3.5mm jack into there. If you have a look now it's come up with the headphone symbol up here. Probably best to have the volume up full on the actual switch and then you can control the volume via the speaker itself and if you have a listen now you can hear it's coming through. Now if you don't have a little speaker or if you like to use your gaming headset again you can plug in your gaming headset. So this one's from the one that I use on my Xbox and PlayStation so all you've got to do is plug your gaming headset straight into the headphone jack there and then it will work here and again you can control the volume because it's on full on the switch itself so I can control the volume via here. This is just a very basic Turtle Beach one and you might be able to just barely hear it. Okay, so that's it. Now, you are going to be limited if you're using your gaming headset. You don't probably don't want to be sat so close to the TV or the monitor because you're going to be limited by the lead here and these leads are often just one and a half meters to two meters. So what you can do is, nice and straightforward, you can buy yourself a cheap little extension cable. So this one here is just a one and a half meter one and you can just plug that in there like so and then at least that extends it out a little bit further. Yeah, you can still hear it or again, if your speaker was located in a different part of the room. Okay, so that's it, a couple of ideas of how you can connect up your DVI cable to your Nintendo Switch so you can play it on your PC monitor. Hope you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up if it's helped you out, please subscribe for more how-to videos. Take care, bye now.